Welcome back, folks, one and all, to Let's Play Goblins 3. When we last left off, we avoided the obvious. Using Bizu on Colossus. It's time for the tiny bug to do what he can. Now, as you can see, this is Bizu, and he is an, I mean, Colossus. So this is an extremely ugly man. Austral, a hair, and ear. Let's deal with the tooth. Oh, he's got chumps jumping animation. Oh. It's a door. I'll have a toothpick. Let's have a look at this warp, shall we? parts of his body as a bug. That works. 
gebruikt. on his head that's worth looking at. Let's have a look. I did a little bit of experimenting, and to extract the grain of sand, you have to go through his left ear. Maybe his right ear. Maybe when they said ear, they meant the other ear. No, no, we're not dealing with you. There we go! Come on. He cried a solitary tear for all the evil he has done. Now kick! Bingo. Quite the jungle. Where's he going? Yeah, yeah, you can't go there directly, Bizu. What are you doing? have so few nerves left in him. He just punches me in the face. You get the toothpick back, I guess, now. We don't need to prop his eye open anymore. Let's see if we can get the toothpick to the baby. Oh, we can smack them on the head! This is ridiculous! We just smack them on the head? What?! That was just like an off chance we could make it play with him or something. Ah, bug! Who... We're gonna smack the base. It's Parbug saying. I don't know what he said. But I think we have to whack them all in the face again. But that will be next time. When I look at the menu to appear. Yes, I have to scroll all the way to the top of the screen to get the menu to appear. There we go. So when we come back, folks, Bizu decides he wants to do the blount, the Blair school of logic and smack things in the head with a hammer. So until then, folks, until then.